Hi, my name's Dave. I am one of the operations coordinators for Shelterbox based down in Helston. Um, today I am off to represent Shelterbox in Malawi at the shelter cluster level. I've been offered a short secondment by the shelter cluster to um, work in the south of the country where I will be helping the shelter cluster to um, coordinate all the agency's response efforts in, um, in regard to the recent floods that have happened there. So here we are again uh, today, myself and uh, Temwe here. Say hello Temwe. Yes. <laughs> um, we are driving up to Palombe, uh, which is one of the other districts that's uh, been you know, fairly badly affected by, by all this flooding. Um, you kind of got two scenarios. The, the districts in the south um, were flooded from the sort of the big Shiri River that, that was flooded. Um, and the districts sort of up here further north um, came out of the mountains. That's Mount Mulanji there, which is the biggest biggest mountain in Africa. And uh, lots of rivers around here, um, lots of runoff from the mountains. So when the big heavy rains came, it all kind of uh, washed into here. So um, yeah, there is a coordination hub up in uh, Falombe here, that where we're going. Um, so things are just kind of getting off the ground a little bit. It's getting better coordination wise. Um, however, what we're really discovering is there's a a real lack of services and, and response to most of these districts, really, for Lombe being one, they've got a really high caseload of people um, in need of shelter. And so what I'm hoping to do really is kind of gather as much information as I can and advocate really at a more regional level to, to get some coverage up here. Um, figures came out today from that we gather from all the agencies and put them out. And um, yeah, it just shows that, that in Sanjay there's lots going on and everywhere else there's nothing going on. Um, so yeah, really one of my main tasks for the next few days is to really try and push to get people to, to come up to these other places and to sort of, because everyone's being kind of forgotten up here, um, Shelterbox are putting a team up here, which is great. Um, most of the agencies involved in the shelter response aren't shelter agencies. They are development agencies, essentially, or people doing wash programming or, you know, things like this. So, um, sort of shelter expertise and materials and just capacity is really lacking all, all the way across here, which is, you know, from, from my position in, in coordination, it's really quite depressing to see our gap analysis come out on a weekly basis and it's all just gap. But yeah, really, really lovely place. Um, so yeah, working up here in the shadow of the mountain is going to be beautiful, but it's going to be challenging for people. And when it, you know, it's nice and dry now, but when it rains, it really does rain and this turns into something very, very different. Um, it'll be very easy to for this place to get cut off, I think. So, Augustine, tell us how it's going. Uh, a number of tents have been pitched and the people are living like a family uh, in each and every uh, uh, family tent. But still more, of course, we still have a car, but uh, I think we are really trying to, to make uh, things possible, trying to make things work. unexpectedly good cluster meeting in Sanjay yesterday that we had where um, the MRCS, the Malawi Red Cross and the uh, Ministry of Lands and Housing actually came along and co-chaired this meeting. Um, they co-chaired it really, really well and it really felt like we've got a proper active shelter cluster operational in one of our districts which is just a massive win um, from where we were a few weeks ago with, you know, really scrappy, nobody quite knew what to do. Um, you know, we've just been pushing, pushing for this to happen. So, yeah, really, really chuffed, really happy. Um, things are really moving forward down there. And, you know, only three, if not four districts to go in the next few days, hopefully. We'll see how far we get. But, yeah, um, yeah, it felt really good. Uh, it felt like we we're actually winning somewhere. And, that, that, you know, there's, sort of, there's hope in the, in the process and the system. So, again, yeah, really chuffed, really happy.